Yeah, I think uh, that the pork producers should be concerned. And b the reason is that I don't think uh, that the, the, the transmission of antimicrobial anti resistance from animals to humans, that should not be the driving factor for the pork producer. In my opinion, the driving factor should be the health of the animal. And uh, you cannot argue that using antibiotics as a management tool is uh, sustainable in the long run in keeping, in keeping pigs. And there are other ways, good farm management, adequate systems that should be uh, put first. And antibiotics, like in the human medicine, should be the last resort and only be used uh, to treat animals that are really sick and need antibiotics to recover again. Yeah, that's interesting because I think uh, that uh, the first 50-60% that we have achieved, that was the easy part and that could be done just by the livestock industry together with the veterinarians themselves. Now we uh, go into a phase that we should team up with the human medical sector and see uh, what approach, common approach, the veterinarian sector and the human sector can achieve to both attain uh, a situation where both in humans and in animals antibiotics are only used when necessary. And that does not, it does not really help uh, that discussion if you put targets from 70 to 90 percent, for instance on the livestock industry. I would say the current level is the new basis and we never should drop beneath that. And then step by step by step, we should uh, make sure that uh, antibiotic use remains low. Luckily, yeah, we've seen some uh, scientific evidence that reducing the antibiotic use also helps to even further bring down the antibiotic resistance. That's an important uh, thing. But then we should just keep on working uh, with the new insights, etc., etc to make sure that both in human medicine and in the, the veterinary medicine, antibiotics can be used for a long time. The reason for coming to this conference is that I strongly believe, and it was even stated by, uh, uh, in, in one of the presentations, that uh, you can only change a system by uh, meeting other people, get new ideas. Ideas don't drop from the air. So you can learn a lot from each other. And the only way to learn from somebody else is to be very open and uh, share your knowledge and experience. And well, this is uh, an ideal situation for that to do in a, in a very international setting.